Tacoma City authorities are getting ready to clear out a camp that's been underneath State Route 509, the overpass there, for at least three years. Officials say the move is necessary due to the growing environmental concerns. King 5's Lionel Donovan is at the camp right now. So, Lionel, what does it look like where you are? Well, this camp does look to be pretty big at the moment, and the Port of Tacoma has said that it's going to take a couple of weeks for the cleanup process to be finished. However, after speaking to some of the residents who are living in the camp, they're telling me that unfortunately this is just a part of their lived experience, where authorities will come in every couple of months, pushing them out of the camps that they've set up and forcing them to settle in places somewhere else. Meanwhile, the resources that are promised to help them get out of these situations never make materialize. It's time to move on. That was the message Tacoma sent to an encampment under the Route 509 overpass near the Puyallup River. Authorities say the encampment sits on land with several owners, including the Port of Tacoma and the Puyallup tribe. But the people here say they chose the area because no one was using it. Because we're out of the way. Um, you know, if you go up to the city, there's tents on the, on the sidewalk. And we, try not to, we try not to do that. You know, we try to be out of the way build a little community. You know, we're all like a uh, family, you know, we, yeah, we say good night to everyone. The Port of Tacoma says the campers were told two weeks ago that they need to move and have tried to offer help, but residents say otherwise. They haven't offered anything. The only people that came down here are police officers and homeless outreach for about 20 minutes of outreach. The rest of it, you know, they, they just asked how we're doing. They told us when we were going to uh, have the move and if we're vets, they can do something for us, and then that was it. So what's next? Do you have any idea where you're going to go from here? None. We have no idea. That's why we push right up to the, the, the limit. You know, we don't know where we're going to go. Anywhere we go, they, this is what they do. They're going to, you know, they're going to, they follow us. They'll come right to us and start harassing us there. I mean, we just want to live, man. You know what I mean? Like, we don't want to be bothered. Now, activists who have been working with the people here, preparing them for the move, have given me various reasons in order to explain why the assistance doesn't really make it down to places like this camp, from the conditions just being too strict for anybody to want to agree to them, to there just not being enough slots available for all of those who need it. However, the Tacoma Rescue Mission has said that they are offering shelters to singles and families, along with day shelters, hot meals, and case management. The mission went on to say that they have sent search and rescue teams to this camp and they have already set up five alternative housing options. For now, we're live in Tacoma, Lionel Donovan, King 5 News.